Hi everyone, I'm here to talk about brainstorming tools and how easy it is to capture and organize your project ideas to help you solve your problems. Fishbones Idea Maps and CT Trees, while they offer different layouts, provide many components that work in the same way. Let's look at each of the tools. Fishbones help you organize the affinities or categories related to an effect, which then help you group the related causes. Idea maps have affinities that stem from a central question and in turn group dependent ideas and sub-ideas. CT trees connect customer needs such as critical to cost to the key affinities and inputs. An important component of all brainstorming tools is the brainstorming list, which lets you quickly capture ideas and drag them onto your diagram. Also, you can drag ideas back to the list. You can leverage work you've already done when you import X and Y variables from other maps. Once you have moved ideas onto your diagram, you can organize them the way you want. You can drag nodes from one affinity to another, change the location of a node, switch sides, and add new nodes. You can even change the type of brainstorming tool if needed. You can customize each node by adding a priority, a comment, or a hyperlink. To make variables from existing nodes, just right-click a node, max lift in this case, and choose to make an X or Y variable. The variable made in this way is unmapped, which means it is not assigned to a shape on a process map. However, in this process map, you can choose that unmapped variable and assign it to a shape. You can select several shapes at once when you click and drag to select the shapes. Brainstorming tools allow you and your teams to quickly capture and organize the ideas you generate during your project. For more information and videos, go to www.minitab.com.